Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dokkan Battle video. Uh, so in today's video I'm going to take you through the 200% uh, Combat Resurrected Freezer event. Uh, they've just put out the new category stage, so it is Resurrected Warriors. Uh, so because Resurrected Warriors is a bit more common, uh, we do have the opportunity here to use double Candy Vegito leads. Um, as I've said before, if you don't have Candy Vegito, uh, using Goten uh, should be able to get the job done. He's 15%, not 20%, but you'll need a bit more luck, uh, but you should be able to get the job done. Uh, so yes, so in terms of this stage, uh, you have two really good options. Uh, you have this Agility Goku, who you could have got with Wish Trips during the download celebration, and this Margin Vegeta who also you could have got with wish strips during the download celebration. Uh, these two units have also been on banners for a while, so you should hopefully have a copy, hopefully have a dupe in them as well. Uh, that'll really let you kind of uh, expand. Uh, this King Piccolo is also technically an orb based attacker, but he gains a set amount of attack per orb, not a percentage. So his scaling is not going to be as high as these other units, even with LR stats, because it's it's additive, not multiplicative, at least for one portion, one component of his uh, attack stat. So, yeah, just taking a look here, um, taking a look at the Resurrected Warriors category, obviously we, we're we going to select the Goku, or I am, because I've got two dupes in him and his SA maxed. Uh, but then what we're going to look at is we're going to look at orb changes again. Uh, you can look at top orb changes of course, uh, the way you can do that is just kind of going to your skill effect filter and scrolling around until you find the change key sphere one. You'll notice there's all these other kind of skill effects here and there. The survive KO effect, uh, just highlighting that, so obviously that exists currently right now, like some units can't be KO'd if they're at a certain health threshold. But apparently we're getting a revive from KO skill effect. I don't know how it will work, but apparently it's going to be coming out with the um, new anniversary. So we'll see how that happens. Uh, but yeah, so for agility orbs, we basically only really get, well, I only have two options. I don't have the 50% support either. Uh, so if you have either of those, you can put them in. But I only have uh, Tarble and the Android 7, uh, 18 here, the Android 18 future. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and take this Goku here because he uh, changes orbs to physical orbs and the Android 18 changes physical orbs to agility orbs. So I'm kind of trying to do like a, a double orb change there. You can do that if you're really struggling for orb changes. You can kind of, uh, also what you can do is you can kind of change all your orbs uh, into one type of orb and then hope that when you use the item uh, it'll change all of those uh, obviously it's a bit riskier but I mean sometimes we gotta make do with what we can do and then yes uh, in this one we're going to take a Turles. Turles is just an efficient all-around support for these stages uh, so yeah uh, the item we're gonna take is Chilai uh, I thought it was Guru but it's not it's Chilai uh, she's the one that changes orbs randomly the agility key spheres and then also gives us an extra 5% attack per orb so yeah, okay, but so now we're going to take uh, Goku. Goku and Vegeta get 20% attack per orb, uh, both of them, but Vegeta gains 20% defense, whereas Goku only gets 10% defense, and Goku regains a lot more health. It's not entirely imperative, uh, obviously, because, you know, uh, we um only relying on the attack stat, but it's just out of interest. Um, so I just quit that stage because Goku is only appearing in the 7th uh, slot. Obviously, as you guys know, all the challenges for this stage require you to beat it within 2 turns. Uh, which means you kind of need to beat it uh, before the 3rd turn when Goku would have appeared to get all 5 stones. So it's really not advisable to have that happen. Uh, I'm going to use the Chilai here. Uh, we get a little bit unlucky here. Uh, in that obviously we don't get as many orbs as we could have, 19, and this multiplicative, so those last four orbs really kind of matter. Uh, and then, but yeah, we'll see how it goes. Um, I did add the perfect run at the end here, so it's 15 mil, it's pretty good. 
Uh, we'll see how much damage he did. With a crit, okay, almost dead. And if we got an additional, he probably would have died. So that's her right there, because we didn't get a full suite of orbs, and like I said, those final couple orbs really push your attack stat up. Um, I do have the winning run. Uh, it was quite doable, I had to reset a couple times. Uh, the main thing is to get Turles and Goku together, uh, and to make certain that you have, I think, at least 22 orbs. Goku will have to additional attack, uh, or Vegeta will have to additional attack, or they'll have to crit or something. Uh, especially if you've only got one dupe, uh, or two dupes like me. Uh, if you've got no dupes, uh, you're really gonna be, you're really gonna be running it close. Um, but I mean, you've got to try. So uh, yeah, if you are struggling to do the new king strategy, just go for the clear, uh, so that you can at least get the single stone. There's no point leaving at least one stone on the table when you can always get it. Um, you'll see eventually I tap out of the stage. Uh, was, it just wasn't going to happen after I realized that that second turn that Goku wasn't going to get the job done. And I was going to end up taking like six turns anyway. Which are. So I'll put the winning run in now. Uh, but same team build, same everything. I'm not going to change anything. You'll see in the winning run uh, there's nothing really much to change. I'll just jump straight into it. Uh, so here we are uh, with the winning run. We have second slot, Turles and Goku. You'll see there, quick pop up, the team is exactly the same. Uh, and with Goku, we got 22 out of 23 orbs. Uh, so pretty good. Pretty much the full suite of orbs. Uh, so everything should be set. We'll see him kind of hit the attack stat here now. 20 mil. So as you can see, those uh, final orbs really do matter. Uh, it does big damage and then he gets an additional. And it's over. So yeah. Like I said, uh, quite doable. Took me about 20 minutes of resetting this morning and 5 stones. So yeah, pretty good. If you have this Goku or this Vegeta, you should be able to get the job done. Uh, even with a Goten, even with, um, yeah, even with only a Goten as your lead. So yeah, cool. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I really hope this helps. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers and bye for now.